Anyone who owns a pet will know what wonderful companions they are. Where would we be without our furry friends? But animals don't make friends with just humans or even creatures of their own species. There are many unlikely animal friendships out there, and we just love to see the wonderful journeys that these cuddly buddies have been on to find their soulmates. From a dog who can befriend three little ducklings to a lion, a tiger, and a bear who won't be separated. These are the 15 most heartwarming friendships between animals. Osiris and Riff Oh, animal friendships don't get much cuter than this. Meet Osiris, the three-year-old Dutch Shepherd who has befriended the most unlikely critter. In fact, if they were in the wild, there's a small chance that this dog may have hunted down this tiny rodent. However, the two rescue animals have developed a strong bond in their family home, and Riff Rat, the baby rat, and Osiris are the best of friends. Their owners rescued the four-week-old rat and nursed it to health by feeding the tiny rodent with a syringe, and it seems like Osiris welcomed the new addition into the family with open paws. Yep, Osiris himself was a rescue dog after being abandoned in a parking lot as a puppy. Dutch Shepherds are famous for their obedience, however, and his new owners decided to train him to be a kind of gentle therapy dog. Now, their two pets couldn't be more different, but they're practically inseparable. Riff Rat even trusts Osiris so much that he will climb right into the Dutch Shepherd's mouth. To them, it's just a game, but as you can imagine, it would be a very different story out in the wild. Hey, hey, did you know that if you smash the like button, subscribe, and click the notification bell, you're more likely to win the lottery? So what are you waiting for? <coughs> Meowie and Jamila This rhino sanctuary in South Africa doesn't just rescue wrinkly animals of the horned variety. Oh no, it also adopted a tiny kitten. After all, how could you turn away a tiny cute kitty like Meowie? This amazing nonprofit is used to working with rhinos that have found themselves the victims of illegal poaching, and often the rhinos have been separated from their parents and left to fend for themselves in the wild. That's exactly what happened to poor Jamila, who arrived at the sanctuary when she was just one month old. This cute creature was so small and required constant attention. Unfortunately, the keepers wanted to introduce Jamila back into the wild, and so they had to restrict the amount of human interaction they gave her so that she wouldn't imprint on them. And that's where little Miawi came in. This cat was an excellent companion when lonely Jamila had no one else. She even grooms the leathery rhinoceros with her tongue. The two take long walks together and even snuggle close together and take naps. How adorable is that? We're just glad that they've got each other. <laughs> Tenny and Sniffer no, it's not a Disney movie. This is the real-life story of the Fox and the Hound. These unlikely pals met in a Norwegian forest when Tenny the dog was out for a walk with his owner, who just so happens to be a photographer. Even though dogs are known to hunt and kill foxes, these two defied the odds and became fast friends. Soon, Sniffer would turn up on all their walks, excited to see his new canine companion. This unusual friendship even inspired the owner to write a book about their close relationship, accompanied with heartwarming photos of the pals playing together in the woods. Knowing how much this fluffy wild fox means to his four-legged friend, the photographer has pledged that a portion of his profits from the book will go towards his anti-fur campaign to stop the killing of innocent foxes to make garments like fur coats and scarves. If a fox and a dog can put their differences aside and learn to love each other, Surely there's hope that us humans can do the same. Rudy and Barclay This dog-duck duo may look pretty odd in each other's company, but their love for each other runs deep. Barclay, the golden retriever, has found a friend for life in four-year-old Perkin duck Rudy, and now they do everything together. They curl up for naps, play fight together, and Rudy even climbs up onto Barclay's back, much to his amusement. But they weren't always buddies. In fact, their relationship got off to a rocky start when Barclay broke into the duck coop to steal the bird's chow. Rudy was having none of it and chased the dastardly dog out of the coop, but Barclay just kept coming back for more. Before long, their rivalry turned into camaraderie and they realized just how much they enjoyed hanging out together. Their owner, Pam Ishiguro, said, Rudy and Barclay need each other. I think that's why they have such a strong bond. They're like the oddballs on the playground. Oh, we love to see a happy ending. Yep, dogs and ducks really can be best friends. Who'da thunk it? 
<laughs> Milo and Bone Digger. We bet you've never seen two best friends quite like this extremely mismatched pair. It's hard to believe, but a tiny 11-pound sausage dog and a huge 500-pound male lion have grown to be extremely close in their enclosure at the GW Exotic Animal Park in Wynwood, Oklahoma. Now, you might recognize the name of this particular zoo as it's recently found fame on the Netflix docuseries Tiger King. That's right, this animal park used to belong to Joe Exotic himself. Suddenly, their friendship doesn't seem all that weird. Their keeper, double amputee John Reinke, who also featured on the hit show, was responsible for the care of these friendly animals and introduced the pair, knowing that Bone Digger was a very special lion. The big cat was disabled and had a metabolic bone disease, and Milo the Dashin seemed to sense this in the lion, making extra effort to comfort and protect the huge feline. Apparently, they even communicate and can understand what each other are saying, despite speaking completely different languages. They even sleep together. This is one brave sausage dog. <laughs> Sheer Khan, Baloo, and Leo. Lions and tigers and bears. Oh my. Yup, this trio of predators are inseparable and definitely a triple threat. Baloo is a 1,000 pound bear. Leo, a 350-pound lion, and Shere Khan, a 350-pound tiger. Each creature is deadly in their own right, but when they come together, they're just big old softies. So, how do three killer creatures manage to live in harmony? Well, the truth is that they're more like siblings than just companions. That's because Beilu, Shere Khan, and Leo were rescued during a raid in Atlanta, Georgia, when they were all just a couple of months old. They were being kept as pets by a gang of criminals and had already bonded with each other in early life. When they arrived at Noah's Ark Animal Rescue Center in Locust Grove, Georgia, the keepers decided that they should keep these unlikely brothers together. Jama Hedgecoth, the founder of the zoo, says that they eat, sleep, and play together and even lie on top of each other for affection. How cute is that? Staff at Noah's Ark Animal Rescue Center have even nicknamed them BLT because they're always together. Even though they live in a three-acre enclosure, they're usually within 100 feet of each other and hate to be apart. Beilu the bear and Shere Khan are especially close as they like to get up early in the morning where Leo is a stereotypically lazy lion and likes to sleep through the day. These friends really are the definition of friendship goals. Wild Fox and Stray Cat when the photographer first spied this fox lurking on the shores of Lake Van in Turkey, they weren't expecting to capture this unusual friendship on film. In fact, when this wild fox was first seen with its powerful jaws wrapped around the head of a stray cat on the beach, it looked as though the fox might be getting ready to eat dinner. However, looks can be deceiving. These lakeside companions were simply having a friendly wrestle and can be seen hanging out and sharing a bit to eat together. How adorable. Everybody needs a friend no matter what species they are. If you're ever at Lake Van in Turkey, make sure you keep a lookout for these furry friends. <laughs> Bubbles and Bella Bubbles may be an enormous African elephant and Bella an adorable little black Labrador, but the two couldn't be closer friends. These two bonded over a mutual love for splashing about in the water at their home in Myrtle Beach Safari, South Carolina, and Bubbles even loves to play a game of catch with her furry friend. Yep, the elephant throws the ball up into the air with her trunk, while Bella bounces off her huge buddy to fetch the ball back. Looks like Bubbles and Bella are living the dream. But things weren't always so great for these two awesome animals. Bubbles was rescued from poachers in Africa and was brought to American Wildlife Reserves when she was just a tiny 300 pounds. Now Bubbles weighs a whopping 9,000 pounds and has even featured in some Hollywood blockbusters like Ace Ventura, as well as chart-topping music videos for stars like Janet Jackson. And as for Bella, the puppy was abandoned at the safari park and zookeepers decided to take care of her alongside the elephant. Well, everything happens for a reason, and we can't imagine a world where Bubbles and Bella weren't best friends. <laughs> Lily and Yoda Meet Lily and Yoda, the miniature dog and the donkey that have taken the internet by storm. Yup, this odd couple have stolen the hearts of people all over the world after being filmed getting up to mischief together at their farm in Texas. Yoda the dog was understandably a little bit confused the first time she met her new donkey pal, but she soon got over her doubts and Lily was rescued when she was just a baby, while Yoda decided to welcome her to the family by kissing her and tucking her in for the long night so she wouldn't be scared by her new surroundings. What a good friend. 
Nowadays, they're so comfortable around each other that Yoda will even jump onto Lily's back and ride around the farm. This adorable duo are BFFs for life. Pickles and Dill Nothing goes together quite like dill and pickles. They're the perfect combination, and we're not just talking about the food. This French bulldog named Dill and a big pig named Pickles have a heartwarming friendship that has gone viral. Yep, perhaps you've seen this messy duo before. They do everything together, including trash the house. Well, looks like this pig's sloppy behavior has rubbed off on this adorable bulldog. The dog was first adopted when Pickles was having a tough time recovering from an accidental poisoning and needed a friend around to keep him company in his time of need. And that's where Dill stepped in. Now, they're inseparable. And it's not just Dill that's helped Pickle. In fact, Pickle the pig has even taught the water-shy French bulldog to swim, and now they love to paddle in the pool together on hot days. That's pretty cute. They even kind of look like each other, don't you think? <laughs> Soraya and Roscoe These furry friends found online fame with their cute antics. Soraya the orangutan and Roscoe the blue tick hound are best pals, and their playful personalities make them perfect life partners. They met at the Tigers Reserve in Myrtle Beach, which stands for the Institute of Greatly Endangered and Rare Species. Soraya is an endangered animal, but Roscoe found himself at the reserve after following a zookeeper home through the gates one night. Hungry and lost, the zookeepers looked after the dog, and little did they know that he was about to meet his soulmate right there in Myrtle Beach. Running over to the orangutan one day, they soon became inseparable. Now Soraya even shares her bananas with the loyal dog. The zoo owner said dogs are usually scared of primates, but they took to each other straight away. Since that day, Soraya and Roscoe have appeared in National Geographic magazine as well as making appearance on the Oprah Winfrey and Ellen DeGeneres show on US television. There's even a picture book telling the story of their unique and heartwarming friendship, and we're glad that these two crazy critters finally found each other. Dude and his ducks Nothing can come between this dude and his ducks. A lovable golden retriever didn't just make friends with these tiny ducklings, he actually adopted them. Yep, the dude decided to raise Marge, Dot, and Francis as his very own when they were separated from their real-life mother. Over time, this gentle dog and the cute little ducklings bonded, and now they see him as their true parent. He even taught these water birds how to swim by lying down in a paddling pool and letting them dive off of him into the shallow water. They even love the same snacks. The ducklings inherit their love for peas from the dude. Very healthy. When these fluffy ducklings aren't nestling in the golden retriever's soft tail, they love play fighting with the dude, who's always gentle with them, so you can tell that they really love each other. Consider our hearts officially warmed. <laughs> Wild Deer and Rabbit Here's another duo that looks like they've popped straight out of a Disney movie. Steve and Vicki Johnson were volunteering at the Lula W. Dorsey Museum in Estes Park, Colorado when they saw this adorable couple of critters. They're like a real-life Bambi and Thumper. This affectionate exchange was caught on camera and proceeded to go viral on Facebook. And we can see why. It's just so heartwarming. This cute baby deer sniffs and follows the inquisitive bunny rabbit through the Rocky Mountains, proving that friendship really does come in all shapes and sizes. Anjana and the Tigers Our final story is a real tearjerker. Back at the Institute of Greatly Endangered Rare Species over in South Carolina, an awe-inspiring chimpanzee named Anjana has formed an extraordinary bond with the most unlikely of creatures, two white tiger cubs to be exact, in the wild, these two species would probably avoid each other at all costs, but here in the zoo, they're practically inseparable. When a hurricane hit the park, the tiger sanctuary was flooded, separating the cubs from their biological mother. However, the kind and caring Anjana stepped in to fill the role of surrogate mother for these feisty felines. At two years old, Anjana the chimp assisted zookeeper China York in caring for the abandoned tiger cubs, even bottle feeding them and spending countless hours playing and bonding with them. And if that wasn't amazing enough, this isn't even the first time that Anjana has adopted cubs. Nope, she's also raised four lions too. Luckily, chimps are strong as well as intelligent, and with thick skin and powerful muscles, they can really keep up with the rough and tumble lifestyle of big cats like tigers and lions. Anjana is one awesome animal. Ziz and Jojo One lives on land and one lives under the water. 
But that doesn't stop Jojo the dolphin and Ziz the dog from remaining best friends, even if there is an ocean between them. Their outstanding differences are what makes their friendship so inspirational. It all started in the Turks and Caicos Islands when Spaniel Ziz was on board his owner's boat, spotting friendly Jojo skipping through the waves. Ziz just knew that he had to take a leap of faith and become friends with this playful dolphin. Jojo is an Atlantic bottlenose dolphin that's become quite the celebrity on the Turks and Caicos Islands and has been making friends with wildlife and tourists alike since the 1980s. In fact, he's famous for seeking out new playmates whenever a boat comes sailing past. This adorable dog and dolphin duo have now spent seven years playing and swimming together in the warm island waters, and we've got to admit, I want to be their friends too. So which one of these heartwarming friendships do you think deserves the best friend trophy? You can let us know in the comment section below. And don't forget to give us a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. You can also hit subscribe for more awesome Missing Files content. Thanks for watching and see you next time.